Hey there, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to check out 10 more games on the Ryzen 9 6900HX. Again, we'll be using the Beelink Sur 6, so go grab a cup of tea and enjoy the ride. Welcome to Team Pandora. Subscribe. As just mentioned, we'll be using the Beelink Sur 6. It has a 6900HX, 32GB of memory, and Beelink concentrated on performance as well as cooling. In the BIOS with selected performance mode, set our frame buffer to 4GB, and here are the rest of the system diagnostics. Windows 11 Pro has been updated to the latest version, as have all the drivers. Adrenaline is at version 24.5.1, and the setting is at default to avoid any trickery. So, let's get to the games. First up, League of Legends, and at 1080p very high settings, we're getting extremely good frame rates. With League of Legends performing so well, it's obvious that the 6900HX can perform Valorant without any issues at all. Down B. The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. We're at 1080p medium settings here, and as the game is a story driven RPG, having FPS at around 40 is still quite playable. And if you want to speed things up a little, we can always use FSR2 in performance mode. A free game, currently in early access, Dark and Dogger seems to be an alternative online take on dungeon RPG games like Mad and Magic. And it's running great. Rise of the Tomb Raider. Even if we don't find anything up here, your dad would be proud. I know, but I have a good feeling about this. Okay, now grab my hand. 
And of course, lowering resolution to 720p gives us much higher frame rates. Next up is Cyberpunk 2077, a game that's pretty heavy on many PCs. And if we lower the resolution, we can make this game a bit more playable. Helldivers 2 is yet another resource-intensive game. At 720p medium settings, it gives us around 40 FPS, but if we lower the graphics settings a little, it gives us much smoother gameplay. If you want to get higher than 60 FPS, we can always turn on the FSR too. We love Katamari Reroll. At 1080p high settings, this game is running beautifully. Hello, Bear. Wobbly Life, 1080p, Ultra Settings. Around 100 FPS, yeah, looking pretty good. Here's Tekken 8, 10 to be high settings, and it sits at around 80% full speed. And if you want the full 60 FPS, we just set graphics to medium. Last up, Banana. This has been Amy Chicken of Team Pandory, and I'll catch you on the next one. Ta-ra! I'll grab my stick. <laughs>